Hello guys, welcome to a new video. Today we're gonna do do something new on this channel. We're gonna do a 50 state battle royale. This includes every US state besides DC and Puerto Rico. Well, let me show you what the wheel looks like. I'm gonna use this one as the example. We spin a wheel, we most likely it's gonna be an attack. Alliance is next, and then Civil War, and then Unify. So, we got Attack. And then we spin the wheel. Whoever gets picked is going to go do, going to attack. It's Idola. Now we re-spin the wheel. And whatever state it lands on is going to get attacked. And it looks like it's going to be Kansas. It almost was Illinois. But then... And then we go to the percentage of the attack. And it looks like it's going to land on 100%. So it's fully annexed. So then we go... And then we go... Oh, I completely forgot. Iowa doesn't border Kansas. The what's the saying consistently? It does. It got Nebraska. And Lava, third state. We got a third state. Iowa kind of is the third state that acts. This actually gives them pretty good territory over the Great Plains, better territory of the go the Great Plains, and they still are not bigger than any of the big states yet. But we get to the next state, and that was just the showcase. So any of this will be now. Now we're gonna be like is act is the actual game. So what do we get? It looks like it's gonna be an attack again. By. Looks like it's an attack from Arkansas. So these are the states it borders. It can be either Tennessee, Mississippi, Missouri, Texas, or Louisiana that they, that they attack. And Louisiana. And how much is it going to attack? A full 100% again? Because we were wiping out Louisiana. The positive about this is Arkansas now gained the access to the Gulf of Mexico. And it doesn't... Why am I... I forgot Oklahoma would have been here. Oh my. Don't think. I just keep on forgetting because this is my third time actually doing one of these. So. So I probably get better when I do more of these. So. So. I heard Arkansas actually starting it off. but And they'll both have attacked. I really do think the what Arkansas gained kind of gained more of a queen border. It looks so be it looks so much better. Next state. Next state. Now I really hope this is something else besides her attack. And it doesn't look like it's gonna be out of the attack zone anyway. The attack is pretty much half half the wheel. And who's gonna do the effect save? Like West Virginia, surprise, surprising, and these are the states that will be for attack. To it looks like it's Pennsylvania. And how much are they annexing? And another one hundred percent. Wow. How are we getting so many 100%? Are we ever gonna get. You see, it's not gonna get completely wiped out? Nope. 
That actually was surprising. Another complete annexation. I feel, I feel bad for the Nebraska, Louisiana, and Pennsylvania. They didn't even get a chance. I hope it's something else. Wait, why am I... Oh, come on. Now a spinner. Hopefully it's something else besides her attack. It might be a unification. No, it's a complete attack. I hope it's not a full 100% again. Now, let's spin the wheel. See what we get. It looks like we got... Missouri. He's going to actually... It looks like Tennessee making the worst borders here. And how much are they gonna take? Finally, not a full annexation. It looks like it was almost heading to 50, but it took over, it's gonna take over m most of the state. We didn't give Missouri all the states because it. Was only seventy five percent, but you can see the we had to draw a new border, and we just the new border is pretty much all oh, leaving Knoxville left. I think Tennessee will need the unification. Not a, we don't want a civil war from that because if they do get a civil, by the way, how the civil war system works is that any of the states that have been annexed completely, if a territory has two. State, the what the other state gets the, the state that they annex will get the independence. But if if a state doesn't have didn't have a state and annex a state, the state will break. The state will be will be breaking off depending on what makes sense. Now on to the next state. I hope it's not attack. Not this again. And now I have to watch it add. Now, what do... Get alliance. Finally, something else. Now, how this works is we're going to spin the wheel twice. And whoever two states that get land on will be all will be in our alliance. How do we tell our alliance? We will give a... We will give a star. Uh, to whoever is part of the alliance. Now, who's the... Who's gonna be one that starts off the alliance? Looks like North Carolina. And who's gonna align with that? Indiana. So, how does alliances work? Well, so how does alliances work? Well, in this game, when you have, when you, when you align to someone, when you, when you get attacked, you don't get completely annexed. The 100% annex will be over there. If there's four people in the alliance, the, the 75 annex will get removed. And if you have six people in your alliance or more, you will only, you will only, no matter what, they will only annex 25% of your territory. So, on to the next eight. So, what is it gonna be? It looks like it, it's an attack. Yeah, it's an attack. And who's that attack on? No, New 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 Hampshire is gonna start off the attack. I thought we were gonna get New Jersey for a second. So so it's gonna be either Maine, Massachusetts, or Vermont. Looks like it's Vermont. How bad we are they gonna get attacked? Oh, a 75% again. Which we could have got the 50 or the 25. 
Well, new feature in XD Mop Hero Burlington area. I think what what's only left of Vermont is probably Brownsville, and they probably also have Ben and Jerry's. So Vermont's pretty much just this little tiny old island, pretty much, but a bit bigger. Dallas think is bigger than them now. Next state. Well, I hope it's something new that we haven't gotten yet. Come on. It almost was a civil war. It's another alliance. No, who's gonna be in this alliance? Who's gonna start it? It's like Tennessee needs a friend. They do really need a friend. The it, they almost were completely annexed by Missouri. With Ohio. Ohio's not a, the best. But Tennessee's already almost dead. So, so if the state already has got annexed a bit, and they're a part of the alliance, then it doesn't matter how many people are a part of them. No matter what, if it's this small, then, then they don't really get the benefits. Next state. And let's see what's going to happen next. And we're finally going to get the Civil War. Yes, we finally got it. So, so, every state is on the chopping block. I hope really not, I hope we'll... I I hope not any of the seventy five percent Rhode Island or Delaware actually are forced to go for a civil war. It looks like Connecticut is going through a civil war. Poor Connecticut, like really, Connecticut really didn't need this. No, no, Connecticut is divided. And it's only the third smaller state. So we just made two Rhode Islands at this point. Two, wait. Two Rhode Islands, but they're bigger. Now, who's gonna... What's gonna happen? Yes, yeah, a unification. So any of these seeds could get unified, and they will have a new name. Or, or the bigger state will... Have their name. Great. No, West Connecticut and East Connecticut can fix their civil war if they if they get picked. If they both get picked, looks like it's Florida with who? And how does this unification work? Now it's either between Georgia or Alabama. It looks like it's gonna be with Alabama. Well, a unification is not. It's gonna. It's not gonna act the same as, as like a, as a like alliance where you where they don't have the percentage, where they where they don't get completely annexed. Instead, unifications. The state that attacks them, it will backfire. And now they will lose territory from attacking a unified state. Next state. And what's gonna be next? Is it gonna be a. It's a civil war. Oh my god, no. So, and also for the unified states. When a unif with a unified state, they also got a chance to appear twice. This can hurt the unification or help it. It will hurt it if it gets picked. Maine really didn't need this. The same way Connecticut really didn't need this. This is a straight border. You might wondering why is this border so straight? It's a 
perfect straight line through the south and the north parts of the state. Next state. Now, what's next? It looks like a... It looks like a unification between which two states? Looks like Wyoming. Oh, they can merge with, they can unify with any of the states. They can even unify with Iowa. And I guess they that doesn't happen. And they merge with Colorado. Looks like we do have a merge. Wait. Wait. Wyoming and Colorado. But I was about to say. If they got to merge with Iowa. Then we. Then the game would be like. It'd be so hard to actually win. If you're not Iowa. Let's see what we get. It looks like a civil war. Yeah, so not having attacks the whole video. Well, what? Who's gonna have a civil war? Mm, it looks like Oklahoma's gonna have a civil war. Too bad. Oklahoma couldn't actually survive. That civil war. They did survive, but they did lose the territory. Next. Let's see what happens. It looks like it's finally another attack. Okay. And this is going to be a, the final one of this, of part one of, the, of version one. Just to let you know. And who's gonna it's gonna be attacking it's like New Hampshire's attacking again What are you doing states? You're not gonna survive for long if you keep on getting attacked by New Hampshire. I saying they might take advantage of of the Civil War. And it looks like they are going to take advantage of the Civil War. They're attacking South Maine. It feels so bad for, for South Maine. They went through a Civil War. And, and now they got annexed. And by the way, if the state went through a Civil War. Uh, when, when somebody attacks the Civil War. A state that went through a Civil A state that has. Didn't. Hear the Civil War, or or is not you not didn't unify with another state? They get completely annexed. It's the same thing. This is pretty much the same thing. If Maine got if Maine got attacked by fifty percent, I'd probably give them the North, though. Anyway, this is gonna be the end of part one. One. Part 2 will be coming out very shortly af after part 1. Probably like in a day or, day or two. Okay, bye.